Hello everyone, in this video we are going to make show used in Volvo Excavator chain. So here I already have created the part. So in this video I am going to show you that how to create that part by using its sketches and features. So I am rolling back all the feature and begin with the first one. First of all select any plane and make it normal position. After that click on sketch. and draw a construction line from the origin after that click on line command and draw a straight line which is 330 mm and again draw a line perpendicular to it which is 200 mm continue with the line command again draw a line 67.50 mm now draw a Line perpendicular to it, that is 300 mm. So, next line which is 107.50 mm. Now, again, draw a line perpendicular to it, that is 185 mm. Now, join this line with the Horizon which is 290 mm. After that, click on mirror entities and select all these lines and make it mirror above the center line. Now your sketch is ready. After that, click on feature and select extrude both command and extrude both this sketch up to 190 mm. After that, we are going to apply extrude cut on this. So for this click on this face and make this face in normal position and draw a sketch here. First of all select rectangle and from here draw a rectangle from the origin. And I am going to define its length and width which is 300.50 and length of this rectangle is 700 mm. Now again draw a corner rectangle from this point. Now the width of this rectangle is 159.75 mm and length is 835 mm. Similarly draw a rectangle here having same width and length. Now the sketch is fully defined after that again Click on feature and select extrude cut command from the feature. Now select the sketch and extrude it cut up to a depth of 95 mm and click OK. Here I am go again going to apply extrude cut. So for this, select this one face and draw a sketch here with the help of line command. So simply draw a straight line which is 184.75 mm. Now draw two perpendicular line to it which is 90 mm. And this one is also having length of 90 mm. I'll draw a line again which is 61.50 same in both direction 61.50 I'll draw a particular line here which is 40 mm now join these two lines having length 61.75 mm after that, I am going to define its length from the edge of the body, which is 61.75 and height of this point from the edge of the body, which is 40 mm. 
Now this cut is fully defined. Now click on feature and select extrude cut. Now here select to all in both direction and select direction to wall and click OK. After that we are going to extrude both. So select this phase and going to draw a sketch here. So begin with the line command. Draw a line from this edge having length 38.50. Now make a line perpendicular to it, which is 40 mm. For that, draw a straight line 61.50. Now again, draw a line having length 55 mm. Now draw a line here at an angle. So far, here I am going to define its length, which is 176.38. So that click on first line and second line and defining the angle between them which is 113.14 degree and again draw a line from the top side this 22.55 and here again draw a line at an angle having length 92 mm that I'm going to define its angle. So click on first line and second line, and having the degree between them, which is 77.47 degree. Now select R command and draw a radius here 88.75 mm, and make the endpoint tangent with this line. Now our sketch is fully defined. After that, click on feature and again select extrude both. And extrude both this one. Select up to surface. And from here, select this one face. And click OK. Now we are going to apply extrude cut. Here we are again going to draw and sketch or you can use the previous one sketch by just click on this sketch and make it visible. After that click on sketch command and convert this one sketch. And here you simply need to close this sketch with the help of line command by trimming this one. and. Select extrude cut command from here and extrude it cut up to a surface. So select this surface and click OK. After that, you can hide the sketch by click on sketch and hide it. Now, here we are again going to apply extrude cut. So, for this, we need to draw a circle from the center of this radius now defining the diameter of the circle is 100 mm we can also define its length from the origin which is 396.25 mm and height of the center point of, of the circle from the origin is 101.25 mm after that select extrude cut from the feature and extrude it cut up to the surface. Now I am going to again extrude both. This one here. So again click on this face and going to draw a circle. Make this face in normal position and draw a circle here having diameter 98 mm. Now defining the dimension of this circle center point from the origin which is 49 mm. 
and height from the region that is 100 mm after that click on feature and select extrude both mod and extrude it both up to 168 mm now i'm going to apply fillet on this extrude both So first one fillet is, is applied on here having radius 35 mm so select this edge and enter radius value 38 and 35 mm and click ok now the second one fillet is applied on this face so select faces Select edge and face and apply fillet having radius value 20 mm. Select this edge and select this face. Click OK. Now here you can see the changes. It is applied on this face and this face. Now we are going to extrude cut this body from the front plane. So draw a rectangle on the front plane. Create the rectangle larger than the body. After that, select extrude cut and extrude it cut through all. The half of the section is body remaining. After that, we are going to mirror it. So, click on feature and select mirror command from the feature. And in mirror command, you need to select the faces you want to mirror. So, select this face. And after that, bodies to mirror, select the body and click OK. So the show is ready for you making chain for the OLED filter. Here I'm going to apply awareness on it. Just right click on the body and here select appearances and select body. And here I'm applying appearances on it so now the show is ready so continue for the next part for the next video thanks for watching the video